pantalla. Numerous well-documented UFO sightings by numerous credible people. Flying saucers tracked on radar, chased by fighter pilots. Nuclear missile sites malfunctioning after UFO visitations. And even alien beings witnessed by police officers and high-ranked military personnel. Where does all this leave us? Four major conclusions after now 52 years, 51 years of study and investigation. First, the evidence is overwhelming that planet Earth is being visited by intelligently controlled extraterrestrial spacecraft. In other words, some UFOs, some, underlined it 20 times, some UFOs are alien spacecraft. Most are not. I don't care about the ones that aren't. I'm a nuclear physicist. I don't care about the isotopes that aren't fissionable. You want to build a reactor? Use the one that is. Who cares about the rest? That's the first conclusion. Second, the subject of flying saucers represents a kind of cosmic water gate. That is to say, some few people within major governments have known since at least 1947, when at least two crashed flying saucers were recovered with alien bodies in New Mexico, that indeed some UFOs are alien spacecraft. Notice I'm not saying everybody in government knows. That's not how you keep secrets. I worked under security for 14 years. Need to know is the important factor. The third conclusion is that none of the arguments made against the first two by a small group of noisy negativists, when I'm being polite, stand up under careful scrutiny. They sound great until you look at the data and then all those anti-arguments collapse. And the fourth conclusion, because I'm such a shy, retiring kind of guy, is that this is the biggest story of the millennium, visits to planet Earth by alien spacecraft, successful cover-up of the best data, bodies and wreckage, for 62 years. Thank you.